guys! So today we are making one of my favorite Pokemon. One of the original three starter Pokemon. Raichu. Oh, doesn't this look like the most perfect Raichu cake you've ever seen? Now Raichu is a grass type Pokemon that loves the mountains and thrives against electric types. <laughs> We're making Squirtle. I'm just messing with you guys. I'm making this in honor of the Detective Pikachu movie. I'm excited about that. This cake was super simple, so let's get started. My name is Beverly Cleary, and I wrote a ton of books that children read in elementary school. What books were those? Why did she pop into my head? What did she write? Beezus and Ramona! I love those books, I read them. Oh, I'm proud to be her. Now to create this Squirtle cake, we are starting off with a seven inch round cake. I'm gonna cut out the Squirtle shape using a paring knife, pull off my stencil, and then just transfer each of my cakes onto a cake board. Now I love Squirtle, I love the Squirtle squad, and after I created this cake, I felt really sad that I didn't give him the Squirtle Squad glasses. That was such a missed opportunity. Now I've got to recreate this cake just so that I could add on the glasses. That's not gonna happen. Oh, Photoshop! I placed my cake onto the cake board and then I added some buttercream into the middle. Now this is a vanilla buttercream, but I'm imagining that it's a sweet nectar pumpkin pie flavor. I'm just making stuff up in my head and hoping that it would taste good in my mouth. What does nectar even taste like? I need to call a honeybee. So buttercream into the middle, I smoothened it out with my offset spatula and then added my next layer of cake. Now I'm just gonna round out the sides of my cake a little bit and then add on a crumb coat of buttercream. Just working my buttercream all the way around my cake, even the sides and the bottom. Now I placed my cake into the fridge and I actually watched that episode of Pokemon. I watched the Squirtle Squad episode. If all firemen in the world were just like a whole bunch of Squirtles, I would be a pyromaniac. Just so I could see them do their work. Light a whole bunch of houses on fire, just so I could stand back and pull out my iPhone and videotape the Squirtles putting out the flames. You see that? That's going on World Star. I love them! Those glasses are so cute! I tried to be them for Halloween once, but then I I ran out of blue paint, so I, I kind of looked... It was terrible. What it was was terrible. <laughs> now I added a large piece of blue fondant onto the top of my cake and I just worked it down the sides. I'm pushing the fondant underneath the cake with some fondant tools, and then I just ripped away the extra. There's a little bit of a mess, but you can just work that underneath the cake as well. Now, I have a ton of Pokemon cakes on this channel. I made Jigglypuff, which is one of my favorites. The Snorlax cake is actually my fave. And I've got a ton of ideas coming your way. Now, if you're interested in seeing all of my Pokemon cake content, there is a playlist for you in the description box, and there's compilation videos as well. So go check them out. Now, using some more fondant tools, I'm carving and creating his mouth. And I'm kind of just making a place for this ugly red fondant that goes there. You know? It's the inside of his mouth. Making sure that I put it in the perfect place and then adding in his tongue. Voila! Look at that. Look how simple that was. Now, my Squirtle is getting two black eyes, which are very much, they're kind of like windows in an old church. The windows in like Bell's castle. That's the kind of shape there, huh? or like old timey door shape. Now I'm gonna add two strips of fondant to get the whites of his eyes and then a little bit of brown detail right underneath so that they don't look so dark. He's gonna get two catch lights. And voila, we got our Squirtle head. Or Raichu, whichever, whichever one you wanna call it. Now I didn't want this to just be a head, so I'm adding some yellow fondant and creating the Squirtle shell. I'm just scoring it with some more fondant tools. And then adding on two more hands with that same blue fondant and voila! My Squirtle cake was complete. What da -da -da. It's super simple, but the fact that I added all the details onto the cake board make this look like a 3D cake. So we got our Squirtle, now we can Photoshop on those iconic Squirtle Squad glasses. 
Wow. Now I don't have to make another cake. See? Photoshop, you did it again. Now my plan is to make all three starter Pokemon. So I did Raichu. Next I'm gonna do Clefairy. And then finally, Geodude. Squirtle, Trimander, and Bulbasaur. I wonder how many of you this is upsetting. They're just gonna smash the dislike button because I'm scrolling up the names of each of the Pokemon. <laughs> now make sure you hit that notification button so you can see all of the cakes that I post on this channel as soon as they come out. I love you guys. I will see you very soon. Peace!